Joe Kowalski with RetainingWallExpert.com. Today we are taking a look at a retaining wall in southwest Ohio for a road improvement project in Hamilton County. This particular series of retaining walls was designed by our firm and the type of block we used is called Ready Rock. Okay, what we have here is this is a standard Ready Rock retaining wall block. The top of this block is below the elevation of the pavement behind the wall. This block is called a freestanding unit. It gives a good attractive appearance on the front. Now on the back side of this retaining wall, the pavement only comes down about halfway. This particular block had a trough in it. It had a channel inside this block. What the contractor did, and we engineered this to work this way, was fill this trough with concrete. This is, this is one unit, this is one unit. This piece of concrete extends all the way through the two units, and there's also two reinforcing rebars in here, and they anchored their fence system into that concrete also. So they have a very sturdy fence, and they also have a barrier, a huge curb, that provides protection for the cars on the other side of the parking lot. We are on the parking lot side of the retaining wall now, and you'll notice that the freestanding unit does form a pretty good curb and a very good barrier. With the freestanding units, you are able to do a gentle radius or a straight shot of wall, and every so often as your grade changes up in your parking lot, the blocks will have to take a step, so you'll have an additional measure of protection here a greater height of barrier, and then the step down, and then we still have enough barrier over here. I'm at the top of a 15 foot high retaining wall, and it's nice to know that I have a good barrier system between me and the ground below. Remember, if you have more questions about this retaining wall or any other project, visit retainingwallexpert.com or engineeronstaff.com.